If you're into internet marketing for any time at all, uh, sooner or later your sites are, are going to become under attack by malicious hackers, by bots that look for weaknesses in WordPress sites. It wasn't too long ago, just last April, when mostly all of my WordPress sites were under attack by a global brute force attack. Uh, even HostGator announced this. And so most of my sites were down. And so I had to manually go into all of my WordPress installs and reconfigure the passwords and set up extra security measures and the HT access, a lot of what they recommend to do. And I searched around the internet and I looked for security of my WordPress blogs. And a lot of them were WordPress plugins. And I thought to myself, well, it's already too late. Um, they're already inside your WordPress. And so this is not gonna work. I need something that's going to protect my WordPress blogs at the root. And so people are not even able to get to my WordPress admin page and it cuts them right off. And also I'm able to instantly change my passwords of my WordPress admin. And in order to do that, it's really cumbersome. You have to manually go into all your WordPress installs and change your passwords. And it takes a lot of time, especially if you have 20, 30 or 100 different blogs. And so what I have done is I have created a desktop application. That's right. It's a desktop application and it works on both PC and a Macintosh and you see that I have one site on here but I can add 10, 20, 30 different sites or 100 different of my WordPress blogs and with one click of a button I can protect every one of them. I can select all of them or I can deselect all of them and at one click of a button I can reset the WordPress admin passwords. With one click of a button I can set HT access passwords on the entire domain and the WordPress admin page or I can remove it and also I can add hot link protection and I'll show you what that is in a minute. First of all to add a new WordPress site you simply click on add new WordPress site and you put in the WordPress URL you put in your FTP login information and password and your WordPress path and the samples are all right here. Once you're done you click on add and you can see that'll be right here. Now I have one blog set up and I'm going to show you uh, how it works here. Don't worry about these passwords because I'm going to be changing these as soon as this uh, video ends and before I send it out. But just to show you what you can do, you can add it manually or you can import. If you have FileZilla FTP client, you can import all your FTP settings by the click of a button and you can also export so forth. So how does this work? Let me bring up a page here, a new WordPress install. It's covertplorer.com. Now, if I were to go to covert player forward slash WordPress admin, you'll see that the login page uh, comes up and I can obviously put in my username and my password and a lot of the attacks come through this page right here. If I want to change the password, I have to manually go into the admin and manually do it in the user profile. Now, I don't want people to be able to access this page. So let's just do a test here. I'm, what I'm going to do, I'm going to open up my software, it's called Domain Security Pro, and I'm going to click on Set HD Access Passwords. I'll click on this, little notice comes up and it says Finished. Now watch this. Now I'm going to go to my WordPress admin page and a cPanel login will come up. You see that? People cannot even get to your WordPress admin page. They cannot do it, but I can get there. Now if I want to get the username and password of this, here it is right here and I can simply just right click and I can copy the uh, login, the username of this, it's right here. Copy the password of that and there it is right here and I can click OK. You See that? And now it brings me to the WordPress admin page. Now what's very interesting also with one click of a button I can also reset the WordPress password. So if I click on, oh, watch this, I'll click on reset WordPress admin password. When I do that this is going to change. You see that? It changed and I can right click and I can copy the WordPress password and I can put that in right here, control V on the PC and I can log in. And that's gonna bring me right into the WordPress dashboard. Isn't that cool? Oh, by the way, if you wanted to know what your FTP password, it gives you the FTP user right here, but it doesn't give you the FTP password in this. If you wanna get that, you simply just right click and there it is right there. Your FTP password is right here to copy. So it protects your WordPress admin page and cuts them off at the root with a cPanel username and password and HD access protection. Now, another great feature of this is to add hot link protection. If I were to bring up this page here on my blog 
and you'll see here that I've added an image. Now, people can look at the source code and get the image file of this and embed it on their own site. And I've done that right here. This is my domain right here. And I've added a test. If you look at the source code of this, you'll see that I've grabbed this image from my covertfloater.com and it's called Namaste JPEG. Okay, that's where I've gotten it from. I've gotten that image from right here. So what hot link protection will do, it will protect people from going to your website and taking image files and video files and embedding those files on their own sites and costing you money because it's on your server. Now watch this. I'm going to click on add hot link protection and make sure that this domain is highlighted. I'll click on hot link protection. Protections added. You see that? So what I'm going to do now, I'm going to go to where this is embedded. Okay. And I'm going to refresh. I'm going to refresh this. See that? <laughs> Isn't that cool? So people are no longer able to take images from your websites and take the image files or the video files and embed it on their own sites and to steal your server time. Isn't that cool? And what's really cool about this is that I can protect all of my WordPress installs. Uh, I can just select all and I can just do my protections with one click of a button and it will protect all of your WordPress installs with one click of a button. You know, it's really frustrating when you want to change your WordPress admin passwords. Maybe you have coders you're working with and you fired somebody or you let somebody go or you have uh, virtual assistants who you let go and your stuff is vulnerable because they have all of your passwords to your stuff. And so you have to manually go in there and change them. That takes that can take hours. If you have a hundred sites, that can take hours. And so with one click of a button, <laughs> one click of a button, you can change all your WordPress admins in a minute. And it's very, very fast. And it got all your stuff, all your information right here. It's all secure on your desktop application. So again, this is Mark Delise and how to uh, protect your WordPress installs from the outside and it cuts them off from the root. Any malicious hackers or bots that are looking to get to your WordPress blogs to make your life miserable. So once again, this is how I protect my sites and this is Mark Lee signing off on Domain Security Pro. Thank you.